Well, day two of the murder trial of a Star County teenager wrapping up. Motive and possible confession discussed in court today. Channel 5's Valerie Gonzalez in the courtroom today. Valerie, what did the jury hear? $52 worth of stolen drugs. That is what the defendant is saying triggered the plan to murder the teen in 2017. The confession was videotaped just 13 days later after Chase Olivares went missing. Now, in 2017, we were at this ranch on August 11th, where Olivares' remains were found. We didn't know it at the time, but Jose Luis Garcia was also there that same day as part of a long interview with a Texas Ranger. Now, Ranger took the stand today, answering questions about the video played before the jury. Over the course of several hours, information began trickling out. Garcia said he delivered a bag to Olivares' home sometime at the beginning of 2017 in January. It reportedly contained four pot brownies and nine Xanax bars worth about $52. Garcia is alleging Olivares greeted him with a pointed gun, saying he was sorry, but took the drugs without paying. That is what sparked the plan that Garcia developed to lure the victim to the ranch where he shot him two or three times, according to testimony. He told the Texas Ranger it took four days to plan that out. During that long interrogation, Garcia also asked the Ranger several times whether he can get an attorney, whether he could leave, or if he could just step out of the interrogation room. We expect those issues will be resurfacing when the defense takes a stand, takes their turn cross-examining the Texas Ranger. Live in Edinburgh, Valerie Gonzalez, Channel 5 News at 6.